Introducing the Sunblade 8000 Modular System, a next-generation modular architecture for mid-range x64 computing. The Sunblade 8000 Modular System allows for 10 servers to coexist together in a single 19-rack unit enclosure in a way never before implemented. The Sunblade X8400 server modules provide the processing power via the four high-performance dual-core AMD Opteron processors for a total of 80 cores, 640 gigabytes of memory and 1.92 terabits of I.O. bandwidth in a single enclosure. A fully loaded 42 rack unit rack can hold up to two Sunblade 8000 modular system chassis which will hold up to 160 cores in the rack. The Sunblade 8000 modular system offers enterprise class reliability with easily accessible hot swap modules which make it easy to configure and upgrade. Front accessible modules include front fan modules, front mount power supply modules and the Sunblade X8400 server modules. Back panel modules include the I.O. modules, one Gigabit Ethernet Network Express module, 20 PCI Express Express modules, dual Gigabit Ethernet Express modules, dual four Gigabit per second Fiber Channel Express modules, dual 4X InfiniBand Express modules, the chassis monitoring modules, rear fan modules. Another key feature of the Sunblade 8000 modular system is the virtually unparalleled I.O. capabilities of the server modules, mid-play and I.O. expansion modules. Each Sunblade X8400 server module can deliver up to 160 gigabits per second of throughput for extreme application performance. The mid-plane is actually capable of delivering 192 gigabits per second of throughput per server module for a total chassis throughput of 1.92 terabits per second. This additional throughput will be fully utilized by the next generation of server modules. The Sunblade 8000 modular system is a complete clean sheet design where open architecture, PCI Express cards and X64 processors can be combined to run enterprise-wide applications and programs faster than ever before. The base chassis configuration of the Sunblade 8000 modular system is 19 rack units high and comes with the following components. All fan modules, front and rear, all power supplies, and one chassis monitoring module. No I.O. modules or blade server modules will be included in the base configuration. At the top of the front panel is the operator panel. The operator panel offers a high-level view of the status of the system. It allows the user to power the chassis on, but not off, and to review the service LED indicators. The indicators are power button on, but not off, locator button LED to identify the system at the chassis level, OK normal LED, which indicates power status, fault LED, which indicates attention is needed by a component in the enclosure. To access the fans behind the front grille, unscrew the green captive screws on either end. The front fan modules provide cooling to the PCI Express Express modules. These hot swappable components have three indicator LEDs. Ready to remove, fault, operating normally. The six power supplies of the Sunblade 8000 modular system are all 3000 watt hot swappable. Each has four indicator LEDs. Ready to remove, fault, DC out is lit, unit is operating normally, AC in is lit, unit is receiving power from inlet. The ready to remove LED will light up when the removal action has been requested by the operator through the chassis monitoring module or CMM. This enables the CMM to be aware that the fan and power supply module are effectively being removed. To remove the power supply, unscrew the captive screws on the front. Pull on the handle and the power supply will slide out, 
Be careful, the power supply weighs 12 pounds and is deceptively heavy. The Sunblade 8000 modular system has the capacity for 10 server modules. Each server module has a number of indicators. At the top, the locator button LED is used for identification purposes. The ready-to-remove LED lights up when the server's OS is powered down and the server module's ILOM is also powered down. The fault indicator identifies when there is a problem with the server module, thermal, memory or CPU related. The OK Normal indicator has three different states. When the ILOM processor is booting, it blinks slowly. When ILOM has booted, but the OS has not, it blinks every three seconds. When the LED is solid green, it means that BIOS has finalized running and the server OS is booting operational. The final LED is the power button. Up to two hot swap hard drives may be configured per server module. The hard drives can be either Serial Attached SCSI SAS, or Serial ATA SATA and they are available in 73 gigabytes or 80 gigabytes respectively. Finally, each server module also has external connectors on its front. A DB9 serial port for emergency management in case communication through ILOM is unavailable. Two USB 2.0 ports which may be used for a keyboard or mouse. These ports can also be used for removable storage devices. A VGA port for monitor or KVM connectivity. This gives added flexibility in the management of the servers.